Hey YouTube, this is Watch Junkie, and today I'm going to review this bad boy. Okay, this is the SKMEI1335. Okay, this is a digital watch, and this is a homage of a Casio AE1200. All right, let's get down to the specs. All right, this uh, watch is 50 meter water resistant. It has a resin case. Some call it plastic. Okay. It also has a PVD coated stainless steel bracelet, folded links. It tapers uh, 24 millimeter all the way to 18 millimeter here with a push button clasp. Also PVD, and there's a writing there. I don't know whether you can uh, read it, but it says stainless steel. Anyway. The back is a uh, stainless steel, okay, writing there, water resistance, 5 ATM, okay, and the model number on the middle and the name, and it uses a CR2025 battery, okay. It has, uh, the back is uh, held by four screws, like same other, no, it's like other Casios out there. All right, so let's uh, look at the dimensions. Okay, the dimension of this uh, watch is 39.5 millimeters without the pushers. Okay, that's the diameter. Um, you have a diameter of 44 millimeters with the pushers. You have a thickness of 14 millimeters. You have a lug to lug um, length of, of 45 millimeters and also you have a lug width of 18 millimeters okay so um, something to take note of if you are planning to upgrade the bracelet into um, like a NATO strap or a leather strap okay you should get the 18 millimeter width um, bracelet or band Okay, so features. Features of this watch is very simple. Um, nothing special. Okay, so as you can see here, um, okay, so you have this circle here that does nothing, absolutely nothing. Okay, you have the day here, it's Tuesday. You have the month and the day, it's March 5th. Okay, and uh, this is on the main screen, or yeah, this is my default screen or menu. Okay, so this is a 12 hour uh, time. Okay, it's 7.52 right now in the evening. And you also have an indicator there for the alarms, for the snooze and what have you. Okay, you can also, uh, you have uh, four pushers here. Okay, so this one does the light and it is electroluminescence light that stays on one push stays for about four seconds all right so this pusher here will toggle you to different menus okay this pusher here on this menu will switch okay the 12 hour time here to yeah the 24 hour time Okay, pretty neat. And this does nothing on this menu. Okay, now if you toggle once more, okay, so this is your alarm. You're gonna set the alarm, not going to go through that. Okay, so this is your stopwatch. Okay, so pressing this will start the stopwatch. Pressing it again, it will pause and stop. Okay, you press this, it will reset. Okay, if you press this again, it will start. Press pause. Press it back, we'll continue. Okay, it also does split time when you press this one while the timer or the stopwatch is running. And you press it again, there you go. Okay, so yeah, pretty neat. Um, what else? Okay, so this is your world, uh, I wouldn't say world time, um, the other time. <laughs> 
says there, dual time. Okay, so I set this uh, one hour later than my current time. Okay, and it says there, DT. Okay, short for dual time. All right, so, and you have your 24 hour countdown timer by right? pressing the same start button here. It will start the 24 hour time, countdown timer. Okay, and you reset that. All right, so I think that's about it. What did I miss? Mm, pretty much covered. You know, if I miss something, yeah, just yeah, put it on the uh, comment section. Okay, so I think that's about it for me and this watch. Okay, um, if you have any question, oh, oh, forgot the retail retail price of this watch. Got it for seven dollars. Seven dollars. Okay. Alright, so that's about it. Okay, if you have any suggestions or comments, leave the message on the comment section. Okay, if you find this video helpful, hit the like button. If you want to follow my, my upcoming future videos, okay, you can subscribe to the channel. Until then, this is Watch Junkie saying keep watching. Bye.